hi everyone and welcome into these new videos sometime uh, in some cases you try to install pbg mobile uh, in your in your pc using their emulator and uh, that doesn't go uh, right for you because you don't have that laptop or pc uh, with the high performance to run the game so in this video i will show you an inter alternative method to do it and play this game in your low performing pc and without uh, needing need of using a graphic card so the software that i will talk that i will uh, show you today is uh, phonics os this software do is that it transfer your PC into Android operating system without needs of running them together, running Windows and G emulator together. It's a separated operating system. So let's go now and download the Phonix OS. Just write it in the Google and uh, click on the first result as you can see. As you can see, we are now in the home page of Phonix. Just search for the download option. We have here the, the version of the Androids that we have. We have 7.1 and 5.1. So just click on download. Either if you want the installer or the ISO to burn it on the CD. It's just to click on download the installer the installer allows you to install this software directly on your computer so we are back now phonics os is uh, is uh, downloaded let's just find the location of the file showing uh, folder and now here is the installation of the software so just click on run as administrator and the small pop-up will appear just click on yes then after that choose whether you want to install it on your PC or in their ISB drive so I want to install it in my PC uh, here shows the letter of your disks I recommend you to install it under the same disk that where Windows is located so the reason why uh, to have this this page when you first start your PC so click on next and choose your size and then hit install so here after the phonics was installed in our pc successfully we will go and start uh, restarting our computer so click on restart So as you can see here we have the choice, another choice is Phonix, run this operating system Phonix OS. If you don't have this page make sure that you have installed the, the operating phon system Phonix under the same disk that where windows are located. So just click on Phonix OS. and wait a few minutes to in order sorry we can film this using uh, the Camtasia so I am using my phone 
in order to show you how you will run run the the software And here, as you can see, uh, the operating system is running now, and it is in the Android. As you can see, I already have PUBG installed, but when you first start running it, you will not find the, the game. Just go on Play Store and uh, enter your Gmail and start downloading the game PUBG Mobile, and after the install click on the game so here as you can see the ga the game is uh, started right now now I want to explain something this uh, below circle here you can configure all your and set up all your balance that you want the the control of the movement the control of the everything why you can set it here if you want to change the parameter this is the default parameter of the of the emulator so if you want to change something just type like this and sit at the bottom you want you will just hit ok and let's go to training and to see the, the graphic quality I don't have a graphic card I don't have a graphic card but this is how it looks on a, a low basis I have a HP E3 here is the model of my PC and they don't have any graphic card And as you can see, I have a very big screen. Uh, it's uh, like a 20, 20, I, I think 26 or 30 around. It's a very big screen. As you can see, my hand. So the quality is very good and uh, let's go on. So that, that's it. I hope you liked the video and uh, if you have any problem don't forget to Tell me in the comment and I am ready to help you to solve it using this emulator and uh, I recommend you to try this this is the best the best way to play uh, PUBG ever I tried a lot of, of uh, method but this is the best way to play it because when you run a separated emulator it's not like when you download an emulator and you run it under the windows that take a lot of resources of your PC so I hope you understand and I hope uh, you like this video uh, don't forget to 
subscribe to my channel and thank you.